Hello. So today I got a question from a colleague about how to achieve something specific in a pivot table and I thought I would quickly share the resolution with you on this video. So the question was, I have a pivot table here and it has product subcategories as rows and it has ship mode as columns and here are sales. And I want to exclude only the rows with a specific condition on some of sales by product categories or maybe I want to exclude only the columns with a specific sum. So how to achieve this? So there are a couple of ways that we can achieve this, one of which is to simply put a filter here, which is a filter on sales, and we're going to say that we want to filter with a buy close, which is subcategory. So I'm going to unclick ship mode. So now I'm looking at sales by subcategory, and let's say that we want to exclude anything that is below, let's say, 100,000, right? So start at 100,000 and we've lost a few rows here. So everything here is 100,000 and above. So if I disable this, you can see that we have a few records and now let me re-enable re and so on. Similarly, if I wanted to remove or exclude any ship mode that would accumulate to less than a million, for instance, I would have another sales filter here by ship mode this time with less than a million. And now you have seen that this row has disappeared. So if I disable this, you'll see the row comes back and I can interactively enable and disable these filters. That's the main simpler way of doing this. So let me disable it altogether. Uh, the second way for doing this is to add an expression filter. Expression filter is simply typing the SQL filter that I want to see applied. In this case, this is sum of sales by product subcategory. And we want this over 100,000 validate. This is validated and now this has the same effect. So I can build this expression filter or I can use the group by capability on the filter here to manipulate which rows and which columns I want to see in my data set. Notice that you could select a group by close that is not even in your visual. So if I wanted this by CT, for instance, or by order priority, which is not even part of this, I can combine and get with, um, and get with different groupings right there. Thank you for watching.